Squid Game is officially a phenomenon. The thrilling Korean survival series is the most watched series launched on Netflix, with people all over the globe tuning in to binge the brutally compelling nine episode first season. Have you ever seen Squid Game characters made out of 25,000 magnets? For those fans who've torn through the series and become attached to the talented cast, I've decided to build those very unique portraits using lots of 5mm magnetic cubes. Magnet Alta is dedicated to inspire and share the magnet passion, and to bring you the best of the magnetic world. It takes about 7-10 to 10 days to build such a unique magnetic portrait. While you enjoy this video, let me know in the comments below who is your Squid Game favorite character. Once you watch the Squid Game trailer, you will know exactly that this series is a survival game drama. Nevertheless, the director and writer, Wong Dong Kiuk, didn't forget to give more taste for the viewers to enjoy. Squid Game includes an edgy thriller horror as well as drama. It even contains dark comedy which makes it even more exciting. Squid Game has captivated audience depicting a brutal competition for 456 billion Korean won, about 38 million dollars. The 9 episode Korean drama has hit number 1 on Netflix's top 10, with millions of views following the cast of all-star Korean actors as they form alliances and enemies through deadly versions of Red Light, Green Light and other children games. Despite its cold violence and blood, Squid Game series features in fact children's games, such as Mugangwa has bloomed game, which is similar to What's the Time Mr. Wolf game. Squid Game writer wrote the game in 2009 but was rejected by studios for 10 years. He once had to stop writing and sell his $675 laptop due to financial crises. In 2019, when Netflix announced producing the Squid Game, they originally called it Round 6. Netflix's Squid Game features multiple types of masks with different shapes on them. Everyone involved with the organization behind the competition is required to wear a mask to conceal their identity, and the penalty of breaking this rule can be death. While everyone in Squid Game who isn't a player must wear a mask, there are different masks that signal the hierarchy of the games. Each one has a different meaning for the person's status within the competition. The most prominent masks are the ones worn by the workers. The black masks are all the same shape but with different symbols to help signify the rank. The different shapes of the Squid Game workers' masks also help clarify which workers do each job. Workers with square shapes oversee the other workers and the players. The Squid Game hierarchy for those workers gives those with square mass seniority over those with triangles and circles on it. The triangle-shaped masks are traditionally the protectors and enforcers and armed with weapons, being a step above those with circles. The circle-shaped masks are grunt workers handling cleanup and disposing the dead bodies. It is highlighted throughout the series that workers are not allowed to talk to their superiors unless first spoken to. Squid Game's workers' masks might be the most common, but they are far from the most important. Considering how strict the operations of Squid Games are, understanding what each of those masks and symbols mean can help bring some clarity to the show's events. While you enjoy this video, let me know in the comments below who is your Squid Game favorite character.
Hello again, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and if you are new to this channel, please subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you won't miss the next magnetic videos. Building magnetic portraits is something unique, relaxing, and very satisfying. If you move one single magnet in a different place, it can completely change the expression of the portrait. Creating this one-of-a-kind magnetic art is quite challenging, but the final results are totally rewarding. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.